In this video, I will teach you how to create this Netflix style presentation using only Canva. And don't worry if you have not used Canva before. This will be in-depth tutorial. This is beginner friendly tutorial. As you can see, this is a interactive presentation and will make you stand out from crowd as we will be linking each text with the page. And when you reach the last page, you can click on home and go back to your home page like this. So without wasting your time, let's start the video. Go to canva.com, click on presentation. You will have this blank canvas. I will download Netflix logo to use in my design. I will bring my downloaded fall back to Canva like this. And let me change background color to black. Now right click on the page then click on duplicate. First, we will animate our first page. On your next page you just simply need to drag the edges to zoom in. Make the canvas small and drag it so that IT gives that Netflix zoom in animation. Next part is giving IT a smooth transition. To do that, click on the middle of the pages like this. Then click on match and move transition. And there is your smooth zoom in effect. As I want my zoom in to cover the whole page I will further drag the letter. But you can do as per your need. Okay this looks nice. It should look something like this. If you can see this playhead then press this duration button. I will show you a simple hack to create Netflix type effect. I have already downloaded the image you can also do it. Now cover the whole area like this. Now it will give us this animation effect. Looks good. Again let me quickly bring this image to our design by dragging and dropping. Now moving on to next part that is designing our home page. I have selected this image for my home page. Then click on edit. Go to adjust. Scroll down click on vignette and decrease it. Copy and paste the Netflix logo from first page to third page and bring it on top. Now go to elements. Search for rectangle. We will create a search bar box. Change color. Duplicate the rectangle or input new rectangle. Change color. Input your text by pressing T on your keyboard. Write your desired text and change the font. To change the font click on this tab and search for something bold. Again add subtext to make it like you are searching something. Make sure you change font color and make necessary adjustment. Write some text like this. So it looks like this is a search bar and reduce its transparency. Click on duplicate. I will write my channel name. Now finally it's time to design the main presentation. Go to elements and search for images that we will be using in our design. Like this city image. Let me quickly adjust its position. Again on the element tab search for portrait images. Here you can use your group image. For this example, I will select from Canva library. And make sure the size of the images are same. Position them like this. Again bring your Netflix logo from first page to this page. Write your text here. Let's decrease the brightness from edit. Our design is shaping up guys now there are only few steps remaining. If you are learning something new then hit that like button. And share this with your group with whom you want to make this presentation with. Back to our video. You need to duplicate the page. Hit edit then select shadow. Hit clothe then adjust its size and color. You can play with this settings so that it create a nice border.
After that change the name of the topic. Again go to elements and search for rectangle. Adjust and change its color. Bring another text box. We are designing this play button. Change font to bold. To make it look like a button let's make it rounded corner. And add one play button icon. If you have any confusion till here let me know down in the comments below. Once our main page is designed you just simply need to duplicate the page and adjust the name and position. To save time, we will use Format Painter to copy the style. Remember guys we are working on new page. Make the second person image big and another person image small. Just so it looks like we are switching the pages. For another person page we will change the background image. and directly drag into our presentation. Make some adjustment. Again duplicate the page. Use Format Painter to copy the style. And make the image big and another image small. Again search for another background image. Bring directly into your design. Change topic name. Again duplicate the page. And search for other background. Let me decrease the background a bit. And highlight the last image. Make this small and this image big. As hard work is already completed, we will design the actual content page then link with our main page. But first let me use this rectangle box for our table of content page. Change color to black and reduce its transparency. Again duplicate the page. Remove this box. Bring the non box page just in front. This page will be our main content page so let's write down our list of topic here. Go to elements and search for these elements to use in our design. Use 2 or 3 icon to make it look professional. Now adjust its position. Now bring text box and write your text. Our 75% work is complete here it's time to design our content page. Click on new page and start designing your main presentation content. You can use stock image from Canva. After using stock image let's use some graphic element as well. Then go to graphics tab. Use these graphics elements to enhance your presentation.
I will write my main content here and adjust its position and font. Similarly, do this for your other content pages. Bring new page, then start designing your page. To save your time, I will fast forward it. We are finally designing our final page. Use one image. I will use this. Start adjusting it. Bring the Netflix image from first page to last page. Now write your text here. Press Alt and drag to duplicate it. Finally to link the document, go to the topic page then left click to see this option. From there click on link. From there you can select where you want to land from this text. In my case it's page number 6. Click on done now do this for other relevant topic. I will link all my topics like this. Now when I go to presentation mode, whenever I click on the topic it will take me to the link page like this. Now you know the basic let's start imputing necessary buttons to our presentation. Let's input back button where it will take us to home page. Right click and select where you want this text to land. Now copy and paste to all the necessary pages. Now finally do this for our last page as well.
Here is your interactive presentation. Now finally download in presentation format. 